You all know my first guest, Oscar-winning actor and comedian. His films include The Fisher King, Good Will Hunting, my all-time favorite. I love Good Will Hunting. Insomnia, his latest film is called Robots. It opens everywhere this Friday. Please welcome one of my all-time favorite guys, Robin Williams, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, sir. Welcome back. How is everything? Good? Very nice, sir. It's good to be here. I got this coat from one of the pips. It's good. Really? That's a lovely It's nice thing. to be Larry Aquarius. <laughs> oh, my name is Charles. And Charles. I love, and I love all the women of the world. Yes. yes. What's I like a lady who could write a good check. <laughs> now, I got to ask you something. I watched the Oscars. I enjoyed you. You came out with your mouth taped. I kind of know the story, mm -hmm. but I explain what happened here. What happened? Well, Jay, there was a bit of controversy. There was a song <laughs> that now I have to go into witness protection for. <laughs> <laughs> that they, uh, I think they found it offensive, and then we had to lose the song, and then... Well, see, but we should explain. This is what really annoyed me. When they said offensive, I'm thinking, all right, some filthy song with sexual yeah. overtones, some four-letter word. At the Oscars? My I, God, no, no, but, but it wasn't anything. It was just what they just didn't like. I mean, tell us what the song was about. Well, well, let's, I have the lyrics. Let's you, read them. Oh, all right, yeah. Yeah! The basic premise was, you know, before we talked a little bit about SpongeBob. Right. And then, but I was saying, SpongeBob's the tip of the iceberg. Here's the buzz beneath the fuzz. <laughs> the flaws beneath the paws. The cartoon characters have a lot of different things going on. Okay. Then it was, Pinocchio's had his nose done, Sleeping Beauty's popping pills, The Three Little Pigs ain't kosher, Betty Boop works Beverly Hills. <laughs> Superman is hooked on steroids, Tinky Wink is in the pink, Damn it to hell, wake up and smell the stink beneath the ink. <laughs> Chippendale, both are strippers, Scrooge McDuck is really tight, Bug Bunny's a cross-dresser, Snow White has been up all night. <laughs> There's something fishy about Nemo, Batman and Robin share a sink, Winnie the Pooh, we know what he's into, the stink beneath the ink. And that's more. It's got a lot of that going now, on. Why, now, why would that get banned? Now, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Does anybody find that horribly offensive? You're going to get letters from Elmer Fudd going, Dear Mr. Wen, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was more protecting the cartoon characters. And, Is that know, what you, it was? Watch out now, Jay. Don't make me mad. <laughs> three fingers. I can only bowl and I can't pick up a check, but don't make me mad. Now, was that Michael Jackson? I'm not sure yeah. what that was. <laughs> Calling Mickey as a character witness in Michael's trial. I don't know what happened. I'm with kids. Nothing goes wrong. <laughs> I wear white gloves. Michael, why do you wear white gloves? No fingerprints. <laughs> Do you think SpongeBob is gay? Did you investigate this at all? Listen to me. Um, I know a, a few gay men living in San Francisco, and uh, I've never seen one in square pants. Really? Well, that. Well, that that's... I mean, maybe the starfish. You don't know what that means. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah. I mean, you're thinking SpongeBob. You know, hot pants. Hello. Yeah. We talked about it. I mean, that's that whole thing about what are you saying, cartoon characters? I, I said it on the Oscars at Chip and Dale. You know, basically, even the name, hello. And if you listen to them speak, it was like, oh, no, no, I insist, no, I insist. Hello, don't be afraid. Oh, no, do it, do it, don't be afraid. Are those your nuts? Don't ask. It's a... <laughs> There's other characters, baby. Yeah, a yeah. lot of other characters. And Roadrunner's hooked on speed. Hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wiley Coyote's sense. always crashing. I, do you think he's got something? I don't think so. I don't think so. <laughs> You know, now that you break it down. You, you gotta break it down, keeping it real for the cartoon That's right, people. that's right. You know, cartoon characters don't have a posse. They should right now. <laughs> Be real with my biatches, all their minis in the car. Stay real. <laughs> Get over there. What are you wearing, little tight pants? Go, girl. <laughs> Grab the ears and drive it home. <laughs> How is your family, by the way? Everybody is good? They're all well. My daughter is 15 now, which she's is... She's 15? Yes, sir. 15. It's a wonderful time. It's a time where she's still a girl, but yet finds Brad Pitt hot. Really? <laughs> At that she... point, I go, he's also in his 30s. Let it go. Is, is she dating now? Is it 15? That's a little well, young. There's dates. There's, you know, she yeah. goes out on dates, but there's sometimes there are group dates, but then there's more like dances, and it's, yeah. you know, a lot of IM, a lot of instant messages. Like, oh, instant, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You come in the room and all of a sudden, screensaver. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> no, 
Now, do you, uh, do you screen the boys? Do you check these guys out? Screen the boys. <laughs> Hello, Thomas. Sit down. <laughs> Tom, before you sit down, would you mind giving me some blood and urine? We're gonna run a few tests. <laughs> Tom, um, I just have to put this shock collar on you. If you touch anything below here, <laughs> I haven't screened the boys yet. I really? Think, well, really? no, I mean, that's, uh, that's a difficult thing for me to go. Yeah. You know why? Okay, good luck. Yeah. <laughs> With a boy, though, it's a different thing when your, your son reaches that age. It's yeah. like you're going, well, you know. <sighs> <laughs> it's that kind of male hypocrisy. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. The boy's getting it hard. <laughs> but don't touch the girl. <laughs> but the boy, go, boy. Hey, you made your father proud. Yes. <laughs> Apparently some sort of pirate family. Yeah, pirate family. <laughs> Don't be afraid to come aboard. Yeah. <laughs> Let's take a break. When we come back, I'll ask you about, we'll talk about Martha Stewart. Yeah. Come on with Robin right after this. Be right back. Come on. Come on. Here we go. I wish I could dance to this. Welcome back. Talk with Robin Williams. Well, Martha Stewart, of course, back at work. Back at work. Yes, yeah, she went to work today. She's out now. Martha's free. <laughs> with the most beautiful ankle bracelet in the world. Oh, really? She made it out of lovely macrame and electronics. Really? really? It's hey. great that they're going to miss her, though, inside, because yeah. she taught a lot of wonderful skills. You know, how to do Trump doy with a sharpened toothpick. Really? Yeah. I made this lovely duvet thanks to Martha Stewart. <laughs> I learned to quilt. Thank you, Martha. Have you, what is your comment on the Michael Jackson? You've been watching this. What do, what do you, you got a take on it? Well, I think the word blackmail, but you hard to use that word with Michael. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 you know, I mean, he's about to jump species, but we're still saying that. Right, 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 right. I think that there is a little bit of that. I think it's just, you know, it's a very difficult thing when you look at all the stuff and the trial and the... Ex why you're under a gag order. And right. We, we won't talk about that, Jay. Not, you can't talk about that unless we do the whole blind your face out. <laughs> Hi, my name, my name is Phil. I have a late night talk show. <laughs> but, but watching the trial, you know, who do they, uh, they bring in character witnesses and yeah. it's the whole thing of, yeah, when they bring in Larry King as a character witness, it's like, okay, game's over. Yeah, yeah, it does. It does, I mean. But remember a long time ago yeah. that Don King bailed on Michael? You remember Michael was claiming racism, which was like, Michael, honey, you gotta pick a race first. <laughs> yeah, right, right. <laughs> Oh, and, you know, when Don King bails on you, that's yeah. like, wow, I can't believe Michael, I'm, I'm out of here. <laughs> if Don King bails, even rats are going, what's wrong? <laughs> it's a now, hard call. Now, Robert Blake, this one seems a little easier. This, a little easier? Yeah. <laughs> a man who tried to hire his stunt double and his photo double to kill his wife first, which is, these are two people who look like you. Yeah, I know, why would you do that? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much going, bad start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bad beginning, yeah, two guys that look like you. Hey, could you whack my wife for me? And you actually have conversations where you use the word whack my wife. Yeah, yeah, that's... They're not gonna take a big rubber hammer and go, ah! Yeah, this is big and easy. This is, and the jury basically at that point, and you also left your gun in a restaurant. What good restaurant doesn't have a gun check now? Exactly, exactly, exactly. Oh, Mr. Blake, you're 38, sir. <laughs> is this your Mac-10, sir? I'm sorry, I don't know which one's yours. <laughs> the waiter, Mr. Blake, you forgot your pistol. <laughs> Is this your shotgun? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> now, of course, Paris Hilton's phone guy. Were you in that? Were you in her? In Paris Hilton's phone book? Were you in oh, her phone book? I thought you were good. saying, were you in Paris Hilton? No, no, no. no. <laughs> now, I know you've been in Paris at the Hilton. At the Hilton. Yes, but not yeah, but in not Paris. Paris Hilton. Right, gotcha, you, gotcha. You. It's like, it must be a really scary thing to find your name in her phone. Uh, okay. In her phone, which yeah, is... Yeah, right, yeah, yeah. To get your phone published and all these names like, yeah. Call these people after five. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Who is it? It just says, she who does everyone. Okay. <laughs> she's like, she's this generation's Zsa, Zsa though. You know that. Yeah, I guess that's probably true. Yeah, so that Zsa, Zsa going, darling, I didn't do anyone, but yet I was still famous. <laughs> <laughs> After the second video, you have to go, honey, we know that you didn't think the camera was on. The yeah. little red light was focusing here. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> what are you doing? Whoopsie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why people are so worried about me. <laughs> Because you're strange. <laughs> You've worked something wonderful into a career. <laughs> now, Charles and Camilla getting married, of course. They did, mm -hmm. which is always lovely that the royal family, all that money and no dental plan. Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs>
You see them and you're going, oh, hello, nice to see you. <laughs> now, and you see this, you're going, oh, my God, I guess we don't want to clip the ears. <laughs> and the boys wearing the German uniforms. Yo. Yeah, I loved it when the royal family puts on the old Africa Corps uniforms. <laughs> and I'm sure there's members of the royal family going, I remember Mr. Hitler came to your uncle's wedding. <laughs> He was so crazy. He was so funny in a chaplain-like way. <laughs> well, have you ever met either of them, Camilla or Prince Charles? I've met uh, Prince Charles, oh, yeah. Oh, no, he's, that's pretty yeah, cool. it's nice to meet him, you know, yeah, when he's yeah. wearing a kilt, he's a fun boy. You're right. right. <laughs> My favorite member was Fergie. I mean, she was pretty wild. She was, yeah? like, she yeah. was out there partying, you know? Yeah, yeah. The yeah. royal family is pretty much, you know, it's, it's deliverance staged by uh, Fortnum and Mason. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got folks with a, you know, can basically <laughs> drink and go, it's the United Magic Kingdom. You know? <laughs> There, there is an amusement ride going, Hello, nice to see you. Hello. Don't be afraid. Stay with the white line. Don't be afraid. Well, the queen is not going to the wedding, right? She's not, eh? No, she's not attending. Oh, I think it's a bowling night or something. A bowling night for the queen? Is, yes, yes. I would love to see her bowling alley. It's half a mile long. <laughs> the corgis gather the ball and bring them back slowly. <laughs> it's bowling night for the queen. I'm, I'm going out tonight. Bring my ball. <laughs> The Royal Ball! Hail to the Royal Ball! Hey, I want to ask you about something. I know you're a sports fan. No, hockey season has been canceled. Yeah, and for, uh, you, what's that like... leave for Canada? Full contact curling. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, not much. <laughs> There's nothing left. HBO, I mean, Canadians are wandering around with sticks going, who do I hit? Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's nothing there. I mean, they have to wait for a basketball game for a fight to break out. Yeah. It's great. <laughs> they, like, the Canadians are so sweet, eh? They're the nicest people, eh? Yeah. yeah. If you go up to Canada, you say to a Canadian, you know, I'm gay, and a Canadian will go, I'm Ted, nice to meet you. <laughs> They're simple folk. Simple people. Nice people, and they always look at the sun going, oh, it's good for us. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Well, how about the, the steroid use in baseball? You got anything on that? The steroids in baseball, I mean, yeah. or either that or flaxseed oil. A flaxseed oil. <laughs> yeah, I rubbed it on, I still can't hit a home run. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> I look at Barry, I think Barry is not the steroids, I think it's Barry hitting with that big butt. <laughs> Just but, kind of it. Well, if you think like, if you think of steroid use, then you have to think of something to kind of compensate for it. Right. If you think like with football players, if they're taking steroids, which maybe, yeah. then you have to maybe uh, say, okay, we'll have to take something else to equalize it, like right. ecstasy. Oh, I see, yeah. So you'd be on a football line, getting ready to do the blocking, going, I don't want to block, I want to hold you. <laughs> Really long huddle, everybody. <laughs> God, this is great to have us all here sharing this energy. I don't care about the flag. Let's just talk. <laughs> you know, just, you gotta duplicate it. Exactly. Now, tell us about robots. Uh, actually, I'm in this with you, you know. I'm in. We're both in robots. Yeah, but you're this... the star. I just have a little part. Oh, star in an you're animated the, you're movie. The no star. one's a star, Jay. The, the star. drawings are the stars. You play, what is, what's your character's name? Offender. I'm Fender. Pretty, the, the, it's right here. One? This is the robot. This oh, is... my. This, oh. is, this is your character. This look, is... look at the size look of that the little shaft. Hold on. <laughs> oh, just like me, it actually winds up. How cool. He's a damaged boy. He's kind of a skid robot. You know, it's basically... I've never seen my own action figure. Thank you. <laughs> I'd like to thank the Academy. No, thank you. Is this, is this your first action figure, I'm thinking? No, no, there have no. been... Um, oh, there's been others. There's been Did others. They, Popeye, was that an action figure? Y yes, it was, Yeah, Jay. they had Popeye. I think I still have the Popeye. Yeah, I think yeah, they yeah. do, and I think <laughs> there's probably only two of them that sold. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, and, you, and the one-hour photo action figure. You just put it in your house, and it watches you. Oh, that's right. I love that movie. Yeah. Now, we have a clip here. Now, unlike uh, the rest of us, you got to improvise all your own dialogue, which is got to fun. play. Yeah, let's take a look. Here it is. Next, explain the premise here. What are we... What are we... This is basically Rodney, uh, Rodney Copperbottom at Fender. Right. And it's, uh, I'm introducing him to this place where we stay with other robots who are kind of down and out. Okay, let's take a look. <laughs> cool. Boss. Robots is a picture and open one. Next week... Yeah, uh, opens open. Friday. Opens this Friday. Robin Oz, you know Andy, Jim, right? I know Andy, right? Right back with Andy Roddick right after this. Robin Williams.